organization wants to empower the parents. And the challenge we are seeing today that um, we are living in a cash economy. Everything needs money. And uh, most of these target groups are living in the urban setting. And uh, the only thing they can do is business. But they, they don't have business acumen. Because some of them are semi-literate, but also they don't have uh, business background. So, but doesn't mean that for them being semi-literate, don't have a business background, they don't have a potential within them. So the purpose of this training is to have facilitators who can facilitate these parents to see that these target groups, they can unleash their potential. I work with adults in the communities. I work with the, uh, even administrators in the organizations or our partners. Uh, what we do with organizations is to build their capacity for them to, to meet the standards of operations. And then with communities, we empower them socially. That is through uh, giving them the trainings of child protection and how they can really advocate for children. The lesson which I took most is how we are going to approach the community and how are we entering into the community and teaching them what they should do and how they could run business. Yeah, what I've learned from this training is that uh, you must plan and do what you intend to do without copying others. You shouldn't be a copycat. But you should be original. Building the social networks. Some of my social networks have been like weak. Others are dying away. I have to strengthen my social networks because that's where I can also build as up social capital. I've learned on not making decisions for the people in the community if at all they have a driving force within them to begin businesses. Many times we've come out to decide for them to what to do, most especially which kind of business to begin. And uh, most of them have failed businesses because it's not them who began them, but it's because someone asked them to begin what he felt. People are not actually poor, but the poverty is just a mindset. Every, every person, every individual has something to offer, but only that they don't know. Some people just don't know that they actually have resources or abilities and skills they have to offer. They only need their minds to be open to realize what they have. Now I've found out that if you want to run a business, he said that you sit and first plan and see what is suitable for you and what you can do. Finding the market and where exactly the strategic place where you're going to run the business. And I'm looking at, I am looking at business in an easier way, the way I thought of it. In fact, someone, if someone could come for a business idea, I was this type. I don't give ideas because I'm not, I've never managed a successful business. But right now I'm discovering my potential after being, I mean after getting through this workshop. It, it has actually rejuvenated me.